Hi. Even though I graduated college about three months ago, it still feels weird. I think it's mainly because my brother Riley still goes to school every day. And I'm just here. <laughs> he's a sophomore in, right? Yeah, he's a sophomore in high school. So he still has a couple years to go. And we share the same room, so when his alarm wakes him up in the morning, of course it wakes me up. And then I have a hard time falling back asleep because I hear him making a huge amount of noise in our room, opening and slamming his drawers, running out of the room, closing the door, grabbing his backpack, throwing it on the floor, putting his shoes up. So because he leaves every day, it kind of makes me think about when I was in high school too. There's one thing that part of me really wishes I experienced during my time in school that never happened. <laughs> and that's a food fight. Like when I was a kid, I would always see food fights in early 2000s movies. Like the most famous one that comes to mind is in Max Keeble, when he stands up on the table and he goes, Food fight! Food fight! Not on my watch! I know that doesn't really happen. I know that doesn't really initiate a food fight in real life. But, I don't know. I don't know why. But I don't know, I kind of wish I'd lived through a food fight in my school days. So that got my little cute brain thinking. Let's take a look at some food fights and see what we're missing. <laughs> food fight tonight. Chaos erupting at Monarch High in Coconut Creek and this video. <laughs> Coconut Creek? This is only supposed to happen in the movies. Out of control kids having the ultimate food fight. <laughs> having the ultimate food fight, <laughs> unfortunately. Ultimate food <laughs> That's right, students tell us this was all a senior prank. Why are they running out? Day of pranks began. What the? If someone threw food in, like, exploded on that palm tree? Pranks began oh. with a super... We're live in Coconut Creek, Tiani Jones, CBS 4 News tonight. Thanks, Tiani. Thanks, Tiani. <laughs> I can't get over that name, Coconut Creek. I bet it's someone throws a coconut. <laughs> this next video is security cam footage, I think, of a food fight at a high school. No way that just happened. No. Are you kidding me? So it's, it's, it's true? Like, that actually happens? Food fight! Food fight! Food fight! Not on my watch! This, has, this, this had to be planned. Because there is no way, no way, that if a random dude just got up on a table and yelled food fight, food fight! that everybody would just, like, partake in it. They had to have all, like, been in on it beforehand and knew he was going to do it. I mean... I hope not. <laughs> In a perfect world, that would be so cool if they all just like didn't know and they just like, okay, let's just do this. And they like started throwing the food and like just went to war like without any planning, but I kind of find that hard to believe. I love it. I love it. I love how this dude just like, is after he yells food, <laughs> I can't talk. I love how after he yells food fight, he just like rips his shirt like, oof. <laughs> Is there a teacher? Oh, there is a teacher there. Oh, oh, there's more. There's two. Is that no? That is that a teacher or a student? Uh, I'm guessing that's a student. Yeah, probably a student. Dude, look at that. that teacher's not even doing anything. He's just like, oh, whatever. Oh, that is a teacher. It is a teacher. Whoa. Wait a minute. Was this dude filming when? Was this guy filming? Before it started, let's go back. Let's go back. Oh, he was. He was filming before. That just. That, this was fake. I just called it. Wow, I'm a pretty good investigator. This was fake because he was ready. Look at. Look. Oh my I can't. Oh, I wish it was real. Now I'm starting to think like, would I want to be the dude recording? In the food fight? No, I mean, not in the food fight, just like presenting the recording. Like, or would I want to be the one, like, actually in the food fight? Like, I probably want to be in the war, even though I get all messy, but <sighs> fake. Ooh. These two videos were actually the only ones that I found that were, like, of a real, I get real, like, food fight. I couldn't find any other ones that were real. But I did find the top greatest food fights. In movies of all time. So let's take a look at that and see how they compare. Number five, The Great Pie Fight, Blazing Saddles. Okay. When Hollywood gets into a food fight, it leaves nothing on its plate. This is our studio. Eh, that wasn't that good. Throw into the mix custard pies, meringues, and probably every other type you can imagine. Actually, yeah, really that's wild. a good food fight. That's good. Now we'll go to the special effects <laughs> department. 
In this place, there are no corners to hide in and no doors to hide behind. Why are they only cowboys? One, two, three, four. There are no corners to hide in and no. It's like a cow a cowboy food fight. That would be interesting. What would they throw though? Just like, what do cowboys eat? Number four, Kiki catastrophe, the Great Race. Oh! <laughs> They had to have gotten this on the first try. There's no way. Imagine if you would have missed. He's like, oh. Oh! Are you okay? I don't think he's okay. Oh! <laughs> you could really see like how people would act in the older movies, like how they would overdo it. I feel like you know, like oh. <laughs> really? Aiming accuracy is almost always Okay, up. I'm over this. That's Go to the next one. Number three, hook. Peter! Kid. I remember this scene. But they- <laughs> I- <laughs> What the heck? Why does he laugh like that? <laughs> this scene always, like, was weird to me because they never had actual food, right? It was all, like, imaginary and we saw what they were imagining. So they weren't even having a food fight at all. I can't even imagine if, like, someone there didn't see what they were imagining and they just like What are you guys talking about? But there's nothing on Are you guys insane? What are you talking about? Whoa Maybe he should enroll in Coconut High School Number 2 Popping Zits Animal House. Popping zits. The Never heard of this movie at all. And if you've ever been struck, and that food looks terrible. This is the saddest looking food I've ever seen. I mean, yeah, there's donuts and there's burgers and whatever, but they're all just ew, gray and gray. Childish, stupid, and oh. downright effective when it comes to instigating a food fight. Oh, he is not gonna throw up. I'm a zit. This is no place If someone did that to me, that would be their last time on Earth. Ugh. Oh. That's a good shot though. <laughs> I bought that pretty good. I'm a zit. I'm a shit. What he yelled it to? Wait, they're throwing plates? Why are they throwing plates? All the glass shattering over the floor and everything? Look <laughs> at this guy's hands. You're gonna poke someone's eye out, someone's gonna end up dead. <laughs> well, I think I can honestly say that this didn't cure my itch at all for having a food fight. If anything, I want to have a food fight even more. Now I know a lot of people might not like food fights, especially the faculty members at the school and like parents and stuff like that. Party poopers. But I think what we can all agree on is that always use a coconut as your weapon of choice, especially if you're going to Coconut High School. Coconut Creek. Bye.